Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Sagittarius, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Sagittarius. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Page of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is an energy of someone who is putting in effort, trying to create a new beginning with you. They are presenting you with an opportunity. This is someone who's interested in you, and their efforts will match. There's an energy of them going out of their way, really trying to be noticed by you, putting their best foot forward. This is a... a, a um, an energy of someone who's conscientious and consistent, like genuine practical efforts are being made by this person. Okay, so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. We have the Four of Swords, and this is Air Energy, the Ace of Cups, Water Energy, and the Chariot, Cancer Energy. Yeah, it looks like someone is coming towards you with a new opportunity, an offer, a love offer for a new beginning in love. With the Ace of Cups, this is someone who's coming with a sincere energy. And they are presenting you with the opportunity. It's like, it's up to you if you want to take it or not. Because with the Four of Swords, there is an energy of you being more introverted at this time or more focused on self-care, self-love, nurturing yourself. You could be healing from something else when this opportunity comes towards you. There's an energy of being on a break from love or just um being more into you know healing at this time and someone could be traveling to see you um this is someone with good intentions that's coming towards you someone who's very motivated to towards taking action towards you towards trying to make something work with you because they are coming from a place of love and sincerity so let's clarify these cards sagittarius Okay, so we have the King of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is someone who's looking to uh, provide. They want stability. They want to uh, be in something long term. This is a down to earth, grounded person. And with that Page of Pentacles energy, it, I'm seeing this as more so a person who is possibly new in your life, um, or someone who's trying to ignite a new beginning. This is someone who's showing up as mature, though. They are ready for something serious so this is someone you can really uh take seriously okay so let's see we have the seven of swords in the reverse air energy the queen of wands fire energy and the sun leo energy so they're very attracted to you you are really uh you know this person sees you as very beautiful you're you're drawing them in and with the seven of swords in the reverse it does show that this person is going to be quite transparent with you there is an energy of not playing games, being very mature and, um, you know, genuine where you're concerned. This is a very down to earth person. And with the sun card, this person sees you in a very positive light. They love your energy. They they love how you look. Um, they also like your actual character, your personality. Um, this is someone who sees you as such a catch. Um, with the sun here and the seven of swords in the reverse, there's again that energy of being open like this is someone who will be quite upfront with you about their intentions this is someone who's not gonna waste your time this is someone who's intentional and um expressive with the sun card here direct energy okay so um i'm gonna pull out an oracle card for you sagittarius
Okay, we have a time to give rather than take. New moon in Virgo. So there's heavy energy of healing here as well with the Virgo energy and the Four of Swords and the Sun. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have pay attention to the red flags the signs are cautioning you so you could be um in this kind of energy where you are more so healing protecting yourself you you could be a bit cautious with this person so things with this person could actually progress a bit slowly um but there is a sincere energy about this person this is someone who will prove that they are worthy of your time you know there's an, an energy here that even if you don't rush things with this person they will be very patient and understanding with you Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have gratitude. Gratitude makes sense of our past, brings peace for today, and creates a vision for tomorrow. Okay, so there's heavy healing energy here. It does look like um, you are attracting a beautiful love offer that can help you to appreciate how far you've come in your journey. There's also an energy of uh, being thankful that something else in the past didn't work out because now this new opportunity is being presented to you. You know, there's this feeling of a better new beginning for you. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a, a card for your advice, Sagittarius. Okay, we have surrender, stress. Take a few deep breaths and exhale the tension you've built up in your body. Let the stress go as you come back to your center. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Sagittarius. I hope you have a really, really good day, Sagittarius. Bye, Sagittarius.